In 2013, the American Medical Association voted, had an unprecedented vote to acknowledge obesity as a chronic disease. Yet despite its prevalence, when we're looking at treatment, we largely relegate this to, you know, looking at lifestyle uh, interventions, which is important. And I really think it's at the cornerstone of treatment, but we do have therapies that are approved by the FDA, particularly anti-obesity medications that go largely unutilized. Our study goes to reinforce this narrative with more recent data showing that only 1% getting anti-obesity pharmacotherapy. My goal is just to let you know that we have tools available. We have tools available that are going underutilized for our patients that deserve them most. We would not deny to care for any other patient for any other chronic disease, and we should not do that for patients with obesity. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.